hey guys welcome back to the channel so in our last video we finished these two staircases and uh, we left some parts in it so today we are going to model the steps for the stairs and uh, a ladder for the side so i'm going to start with the steps and for that let's take a cube increase the width height and depth place it here like this go to front view and uh, you can scale this like this or what you can do is you can go to vertex mode select the vertices place them here like this uh, maybe press V and snap them here like this decrease the height just a little bit I think 4 should be fine push it back just a little bit maybe a little more like this now let's add some details so what i'm going to do is uh, i'm going to go to edge mode select this edge then split it and uh, then select this one and split again now select both of them and uh, bevel increase the fraction like this select these two and scale them to move them further apart like this now select this face and uh, intrude it like this you can add a little bit of offset like this now let's select this and uh, we are going to create some duplicates and place them along with this stair so select it like this and place it here and press shift D to duplicate with transformation. So if you think that it moved ahead like this, you can just push it back. Repeat the same thing with all the others. but there is one thing that we need to do is and i'm going to select all these steps and uh, group them rename it as stairs steps and then select the entire stair and move it back like this So this is more practical. Now let's create the ladder. So I'm going to take another cube, bring this back and increase the width, height and depth. I'm taking the width 4.5 and depth as same. Increase the height for a front view. Now 
और वर्टेक्स मोर से लगती वर्टिस पुल दैम डाउन मे बी ए लिटिल बिट ऑफ मोर वेट एंड डेप्थ गो टू एच मोड सेलेक्ट दिस एच देन स्प्लिट सेलेक्ट इट अगेन एंड बेवल नाउ सेलेक्ट दीज फेसिस देन इंक्लूड लाइक दिस आई एम गोइंग टू गो टू एच मोड सेलेक्ट एवरीथिंग एंड बेवल इट सो दैट वी कैन गेट सम स्मूथ कॉर्नर्स like this and uh, let's select it create a duplicate and place this one here like this now let's create the steps for this part and for that i'm going to take a cylinder bring this out and up here increase the radius and height i'm going to take the subdivisions 12 for this go to front view and rotate it decrease the radius we are going to fit this cylinder inside this part here like this go to front view again and what i'm going to do is i'm going to go to face mode and delete the faces on the sides these faces are not going to be visible so we don't need them again go to front view go to vertex mode select the vertices and snap them to this side like this push it inside to hide this repeat the same thing on this side like this again go to mesh display and set it to soften edge now go to front view create a duplicate push this down here and press shift d to repeat with transformation and we are done with this i'm going to group it and rename it as ladder now go to right view select your ladder go to modify center pivot and place it against this railings so our staircase is completed now i'm going to delete this platform here and enable my base and what you can do is you can just select everything like this and you can go to right view and let's add this in a group and rename it as escape platform 1 you can just create a duplicate and place it up here just like this to create more levels 
and then you can press shift d again move up here and then again press shift d repeatedly and it's going to create this very simple but amazing firescape for the buildings we are done with the modeling and uh, in our next part we are going to unwrap the whole thing and then texture it in substance painter so i hope you enjoyed this video and in the uv unwrapping we are going to do a lot of repeated stuff so i'm just going to show you uh, how to unwrap uh, one object and we're going to transfer the uvs for these similar objects and if you want to see how you can do that uh, i'll drop the link in the description or you can click on the i button to watch that tutorial so if you enjoyed this video then make sure to like this video and if you are new to this channel then subscribe and i'll see you in the next one thanks for watching